This next one is something I'm really excited to talk about. We've already unpacked it multiple times, but it's never enough for me because this is the most exciting news in West Coast hip hop in several years. O3 Greedo was released on Thursday, January 12th, after being in prison for the last four and a half years. According to the Texas Department of Criminal Justice, the Los Angeles rapper was scheduled to be released on parole. After a successful parole hearing in late June, Greedo spent the past several weeks completing a program to earn his freedom. He put out a mixtape celebrating his release, Free 03, on, Jan on Tuesday, January 10th. Police charged Greedo with drug and gun possession in 2018 after searching a car on a dubious pretext in which he had been traveling, as the Washington Post reported, in 2020. Greedo was convicted of possessing more than 400 grams of methamphetamine and of unlawful possession of a firearm by a felon. Um, and, you know, he did Fed time, apparently. I guess he yeah. was somewhere in between. He was in Texas, allegedly traveling between Tennessee and L.A. Um, on, a, you know, part of a drug pipeline, wound up getting wrapped up. Um, I think that he, I don't know if he was the passenger or the driver, but I know that there is definitely um, things were brought into the question on the legality of the search. That was mm -hmm. one of the things they were trying to fight when they were, when he was on trial. But, I mean, they were talking about 20 years. So the fact that he got out now is incredible. And uh, hopefully there's, you know, all that's legit. But, with that being said, the most versatile, interesting, yeah. and exciting artist in the West Coast in a long time. I'm juiced to see what he brings. It sucks. Like I, I felt bad for him when Draco died. Him hearing that news, yeah. being locked up for all that. It it's it's a definite tragedy that the two of them couldn't have had another run together because um, yeah. they work so well together and they're different, unique styles really offset each other. Um, well, but I'm juiced about this. Welcome home, Greedo. I'm sure, like you just said, it's unfortunate that Draco's gone and now, you know, he just got out. But I'm almost like, for certain, I know that they got shit in the vault together that that can be released. So I'm praying that that comes out. I'm super excited to hear him. I don't know if he might do a, a 03 Flow remix with Wally. I would love to hear that shit. I want to see what him and Blast going to do. I want to hear shit with him and Roddy. Like People really Greedo. criticize, like... um west coast music a lot right they say yeah. it's super regional they say that like it doesn't go beyond the bubble i think like roddy's really the last star we had break on a national level mm -hmm. greedo is up next as far as i'm concerned i know he's a little older but i think he's mm -hmm. definitely greedo is up definitely up next and like you said he's the most versatile like nationally not yeah. just regionally yeah so i'm excited to see what he gonna do i seen a tweet somebody said uh, i hate that y'all expect this nigga to go hop straight into the studio like he don't got a family or something like that <laughs> But, like, I'm thirsty for another 03 Greedo project. He for sure went to the studio already. That nigga was for sure at the studio, on. and I hope he did a first day out. I hope so, too. Yeah. You know, um, well, welcome home, 03. We missed you. We need you. This is going to shake the game up. The streets yeah. need this. The game needs this, you know. This might be the best news I heard 2023. Shouts we to the got Greedo back, nigga. Definitely. Shouts yeah. to the Wolf of Grape Street. Shouts to all the homies from the Jordan Downs. It's dope to see him back home. Back. Shout out to them niggas over there.